how would you feel if after being cancer free for five years, you went back to your doctor's office and she told you that you had cancer again? Not only that, but now your cancer has spread to your lymph nodes, to your chest, and to your liver. That is metastasis, and it's responsible for 90% of all cancer deaths. People get diagnosed with cancer when they find an abnormal mass of cells somewhere in their bodies. Fortunately, with the recent medical advances, we have several treatments available, and it's not often fatal. Metastasis, however, is still not well understood not preventable and not treatable. So what is metastasis? In essence, it's the spreading of the tumor. What happens is, within the first mass of cells, some of them are able to escape and they travel around until they reach a different organ and form another tumor. And as the disease gets worse, they colonize more and more organs, causing organ malfunction and eventually death. The main focus of my research is to better understand this disease, and specifically, what is allowing these cells to spread and cause metastases. We found that some cancer patients have a protein called podocalyxin or podo in their tumors. So I compare cells with and without this protein and found that only the ones that have this protein are able to travel from the original tumor all the way to the lung and cause metastasis. Hence, my research shows that POTA has a vital role in the ability of cancer to spread in the body. I believe POTA acts like Teflon. Imagine a cancer cell surrounded by a non-stick Teflon coating. It can move freely between cells until it reaches another organ and forms a tumor. So what if a treatment for metastasis was as simple as removing that Teflon coat. Could we stop the cells from moving? The results from my research say yes. And as you can see in the right side of my slide, with the cancer cells being the green dots, we have developed a treatment that can stop the cells from reaching the lungs. This drug can target PODO on cancer cells and blocks them from invading other organs. So with better research and understanding, we hope to be one step closer to treating thousands of people that suffer from metastasis. Thank you.